So, I have question the panel here. So, we're talking about what are the safety equipment used for surface preparation and painting works and descriptions. So, the first is gloves. Always wear to protect your hand. Always wear gloves to protect your hands. Leather or cloth gloves are sufficient for sanding. The second is eyewear. Eyewear is used protective eyeglasses, eye goggles, or a face shield when every handling paint or paint thinners. So the third is paint mask. Paint mask is where a dust, where a where a dust mask, or particular respiratory wind sanding. If you are very sensitive to chemicals, chemicals, you should also wear a respiratory mask when using a brush or roller the fourth is cover all and shoe cover cover alls and shoe covers this is a dispos disposable or cotton cover all and disposable shoe covers serve to protect both your clothing and exposed skin that you could became irritated by contact with paint the the next is hard hat hard 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 hat is if you are working at highs hard hat is a wise safety precaution precaution as it can help you protect your head if you fall additional if you are working in a busy construction site it will protect your head if an object falls on you the next is fall arrest. Fall arrest is a system can consist of a single carabari, carabiner or double carabiner that can be attached to a railing to prevent you from falling. It often comes with har harness and the straps around the torso or legs for added safety. The next is fire extinguisher. It is it is always to keep a fire fire extinguisher inside in case there are in there are any incidents with flammable materials such as a paint thinner. The next is brush painting. Brush painting is the most basic type of painting. It it is commonly used to paint wood, for example, window wheels, dome frames, other wood, other woodwork. It is also used for decorative paint styles can be used for walls. The next is roller application. R roller ap application is frequently used for interior walls and ceilings. Legs include paint splashes on the skin and the eyes. Painters can also run the risk, risk of pulling a muscle off or incurring another type of injury. Though working on uncomfortable position for a long period of time the next is spray painting spray painting is a most often used for large surfaces such as lobbies ex and exterior of large buildings Painter painters run the risk of getting paint particles in their eyes paint for this reason health and safety precaution and equipment are extremely important for spray painting the lastly is painting at highs the painting of anything that is not ground level can be dangerous painters can be injured themselves if severely by just falling of a step ladder those who work at highs must take considerable safety precaution as a fall with fatal this may involve scaffolding or safety harnesses so that's all for today thank you